Hello and welcome to channel Unlocks Hub. I hope you guys are safe. Please follow the guidelines and instructions given by your local authorities and stay safe from this coronavirus or COVID-19. In this video, I'll be showing you how to remove iCloud or activation lock permanently on an iPad mini. This method works on all iPads. So I have an iPad mini here. Today I'll be showing you on this particular device. You can watch our other videos as well. We have done on multiple other devices, including the iPhone, iPads and uh, iPods. You can watch those videos as well. If you have any doubts, please let us know in the comment section below this video. If you need the firmware, please mail us on our mail ID given in the description box below the video. Let me open this and now the first step is to put the device into DFU mode. To do that, turn off the device. Now just hold the home button and the power button simultaneously and as soon as the Apple logo disappears you have to let go of the power button and keep pressing the home button. So here it says DFU mode. Now just click on query compatible SHSH Once that is done you have to import the firmware by clicking on this and select the unlock sub iPad mini custom IPSW and click on open Now just click on the flash option here Now wait for the package to unpack and then install on this particular iPad. This whole process takes somewhere around uh, 20 minutes. So make sure you have enough time to do it. Do not unplug your device at any point of time. It says flash failed, do not worry, click on ok and click on ok once again. Now hold shift and click on restore ipad and select the unlocks hub ipad mini custom ipsw and click on open, click on restore. You can now see the 
firmware is being installed. Please wait for it to complete the installation process. If you need the software, please mail us on our mail ID given in the description box below this video. If you have any doubts, please let us know in the comment section below this video. Please do watch our other videos as well. We have done multiple videos including iPhone 10, iPhone 7 Plus, 6 and other iPads too. It says your iPad has been restored, please wait, let's just wait for the iPad to turn on all by itself.
you can now see that the second stage of installation has started this is the stage where the iCloud data is loaded back to the device do not unplug it wait for the device to turn on completely You can see that the iTunes has already detected this iPad but please wait for the iPad to turn on completely and also set up as a new iPad only. Click on continue. It's now in the hello screen. Let me just set it up quickly. I'm setting it up using iTunes. You can do the same too. It says welcome to iPad, click on get started and now you are inside this iPad. Let me go to settings and iCloud so you can sign in with your own Apple ID and password. And this is not yet jailbroken so you can jailbreak it as and when required. So this iPad here is completely iCloud unlocked so you can use it without any issues. This is the same iPad mini with which I started this video. If you have any doubts please let us know in the comment section below this video. If you need the firmware please mail us on our mail id given in the description box below the video. You can watch our other videos too. Please stay safe and thank you for watching. See you in our next video. Bye-bye.